My name's Graham Ingle. I'm a paint technician and I work at Marshalls Motor Group. I was on a work experience and my, the school I was, work, was with sent me to a, a they call garages in, not body shops. And uh, I stayed there for two weeks and then they asked me if I wanted a job. So I did a four years apprenticeship and then a year's approval. In paint spraying, each job is a challenge. It doesn't matter how good you are, you could be doing 28 years, three years, four years. Every job's a challenge. You can't get it right all the time. When the car comes down, it's all the fillers rubbed down and it's ready for us to flat back the edges and then we prime it up and then we put it in the, where, where it's in the oven, it's primed up, baking off and then it'll come out and then we'll flat it all down and then we'll mask it out and we'll spray it and, and get it all ready for it to go down to the other end to be fitted up. No, I mean, the cars come down and you find the colour codes, which are in the cars, probably under the bonnet, in the door shuts, and then uh, it'll come up with a number, let's say one, two, three, and then we'll go get the colour swatches for a Mishibutsi, and uh, we'll go for the swatches, and it'll say one, two, three on the back of the swatches, and it'll come up with a colour. There is satisfaction in doing a job, especially when new paints come out, new colours, and things you haven't done before. The most satisfaction I do get is when the job comes out the oven and everything's right. The colours are right, the shine's there, everything's perfect. To be a good paint spray, you need a lot of patience. If you haven't got patience, don't do the job because you can take the job home with you and it'll be stuck in your head all the way through the night and you just won't get any sleep. You need patience to do this job.